Hi, this is Nadia from Lifter LMS. So in this video, I will discuss about Lifter LMS student dashboard. Lifter LMS student dashboard basically a dashboard where students can see all their details, including their courses, their oral histories, all their personal information. As you can see, it's a student dashboard where students can see all their enrolled courses, their grades, then uh, here you can see the grades. Uh, I have all the course grades here. I have for the progress bar. I have the enrollment date. And also I can see my memberships, my groups, and my achievements as a student from here. Here is my student achievements. And I can see my notes, certificates, my favorites, and everything I have on my course or related to my course. So here's my notes. So I'm showing you, uh, I'm showing you the student experience. Student will be uh, logged in on their dashboard and they will be able to see the same thing from their front end. And every student has their own dashboard. So it's a unique one. So I'm showing you at this as an admin. So for example, uh, some customer wants that they want to remove uh, some of the endpoints from the student dashboard. As you can see on the on my left side here, we have dashboard, my profiles, my courses. These are the endpoints. So if you want that you will, as an admin, you will remove any of them and your student will not be able to uh, show uh, see this on this uh, left side, you can do that. For example, I want to remove this my memberships option as an admin. I don't want my students show this my uh, see this my memberships option. So what I have to do, I have to visit Lifter LMS and settings, then accounts. So here is all the student dashboard endpoints. You can modify this slug or you can remove any of these endpoints if you want as an admin. So I will remove this one and I will save changes. So now if I visit dashboard, so as a student, now I can't see that my membership endpoints. So this is how you can remove, for example, if you want to create a new uh, a student dashboard, custom new uh, student dashboard, or if you, you have deleted accidentally your previous dashboard, you can uh, create a new dashboard or custom dashboard following the steps. So I'm showing you that now. So for that, we have to visit our backend. Then we have, to, I, do, I will just delete my current dashboard page so that I can show you all the steps. So I'm deleting this. And now I have to create a new page for that first. So you can see I don't have the dashboard page now. So I'll create a new page now. So. I will add a page title now. Publishing this page, I have to add a shortcode here that will be my account shortcode. So if you search Lifter LMS shortcodes, you will get all our shortcodes. So here's the shortcode documentation. So if I click on this my account option, so here is the my account shortcut. I will copy it and will paste it on the page. So I will add shortcut block here. Publish this. After that, we have to visit Lifter LMS and settings. Then we have to add this page on our dashboard option. So now accounts. So here we have to select our new page. So I will select my new dashboard page here. And save changes. So if I visit my page, dashboard page, student dashboard page basically. So here is my new student dashboard page, but the width is not perfect now. So what we have to do, we have to fix the width. So I will visit dashboard page. So I'll click on edit. I will just change the template so that it shows as a full width. So from the right side, here we have template. We have to select here and we will click on swap template option. And here we have full width, have to select this one and we are good to go. 
now I will update it. If I visit my page now, I will see a full with student dashboard. So here it is. So this is how a student can see their dashboard page. Um, this is really perfect. We have used our SkyPilot theme for this tutorial. So I hope this video will be helpful for you. Thank you so much for watching.